Hey everybody, today I want to talk to you guys about um, making a bunch of copies of like whatever you're filming or doing on uh, motion, like make a bunch of copies of it, replicating it pretty much. Um, I don't think you guys understand much. If you do, good job, but if you don't, here I'll show you. Say I want to replicate this movie, okay, this. So what you're going to do is you're going to have it selected and then press L on your keyboard. Now you come up with this. Now if you were to play this, it would just look like this. A blob. But if you wanted to make it better, you, you can click on one of the X's on the outside. So I'm going to click on this one X. Like that. Click on this X. Make it go higher. Click on this one. Okay, now I can move around. And there we are. It's replicated. And obviously if you go in the library, there's something called replicators. Those are just ones that repeat themselves. But, you don't really do that. But, yeah, uh, that's all it, it is. So if you look at that, woo, woo, woo. I got this machine gun from footagecrate.com. But, and if you're done replicating, just press transform. Because replicator can come at the bottom. But then, uh, don't get rid of, like, your base clip. Just don't. It's pretty cool, though, how, uh, your clip is really short, but this will keep going on, even though it is short. So, like, it's past the clip. And, yeah, it's still going. Don't get rid of it, though, then it'll stop. So. Uh, if you were to take a random clip in, it wouldn't say replicator, you have to actually press L, then it'll be replicator. I'm actually gonna screen all of this. So. So yeah. Thanks guys for watching, I uh, really appreciate it. Hope you guys have a good day. Bye bye now.